What's up, what's up, what's up, everybody? I don't think I got the music. Nope, no music. But anywho, I'm going to go ahead and say what I had to say because I didn't already started it. So, let's see. I see some of y'all moving in silence or some of y'all ain't saying shit to somebody. Y'all ain't saying shit or you moving in silence and they trying to figure out what the fuck you got going on. Because this person ain't shit, okay? I guess you see they ain't shit. They do the same shit. It ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? To you, you feel like they ain't shit. But really, they crying over you. Like, they real upset because they ain't heard from you. You don't know what the fuck going on. You feel what I'm saying? They've been crying sad and hurt upset about you. Okay, they already going through some type of karma because they've been playing games. Like, acting like they don't care and nonchalant, but really they care. So now they're getting their ass whooped internally because they hiding feelings that they really didn't want you to know about so you felt unappreciated so you kind of moved in silence you got the hell out the way then nobody ever heard from you ain't saying shit to nobody but really in real life this person obsessed with you okay obsessed i don't know if this is a karmic or what okay y'all moving like i don't know if you're moving did you move to another spot did you get removed to another job place you know what i'm saying you could have got transferred somewhere else they don't know what's going on because they haven't heard from you. You didn't kind of like cut somebody off cold turkey. They don't know what the fuck going on. You just moved the hell out the way. So they sitting here been creeping, you know, trying to figure out what's going on. Or they feel like that you moved away. Well, you stopped talking to them because you knew they been creeping and fucked around and caused the STD. And that's why you ain't interested in them at their ass no more. So somebody abusing divination trying to find out what you got going on because... You, they ain't heard from you, they can't see. Because they know if they can't reach out to you directly, ain't no way they're going to run across you at all. So since you cut off all connections, any way for them to contact you, one thing they can do is divination. Somebody abuse divination, but I'm also getting somebody doing some type of love spell. Did I say what's up, what's up, what's up, y'all? How y'all doing, how you doing? But anyway, abuse some type of divination, okay? Maybe trying to do like a love spell or come to me spell or just watching or doing some type of reading to see what you got going on. But as they see, you still unbothered. You are unbothered. You don't give a fuck, okay? You ain't, this shit ain't phasing you at all, okay? And somebody feel like you are interested because they didn't call the case. Because they you know they've been creeping, catching the case. Okay? So y'all been traveling. Y'all been moving. It's like somebody cannot catch you. When they try to pull up in your house to catch you, you ain't even there. Like, when the fuck you ain't never home? Who they fucking with? Who they hang with? You traveling. Some of y'all could be going on a vacation. Maybe I went on a vacation and didn't tell nobody. Okay? And they, somebody try to figure out what's going on. I call my friends. So some of y'all got friends that be all up in your business. Got to know everything that's going on with you. Everything that's going on with you. Okay, this person would seek competition. The only reason they were so close to, to study you so they could be in competition with you or take what you got going on or make it theirs. Okay? But you, I feel like you done cut this person off too. I feel like nobody knows what the fuck you got going on, but you didn't silently cut people off or you just moving aside, you just doing you, okay? I feel like you doing your self time, but you dodged the bullet from something. Probably that first person you moving in silence for that's all hurt. It was capping like it ain't what it is, but it is what it is because they really obsess over you in real life, okay? When they front like they ain't, okay? But this person be creeping and shit, you know what I'm saying? We fucked around and caught some shit. They, I guess they had to feel like they were still a man or still a girl or something. Still got it like that. Drop it like it's hot. Something like that, okay? But y'all dodged the fucking bullet by blocking these people, okay? You blocked off negative-ass people. Okay, so somebody was acting like they was one they one, one way. Like they all, like, conservative and this, this. But really, this person's a whole karmic. So they, like, got a lot of skeletons in their closet that they don't really bring out. Okay, but you escaping these crazy ass people and these haters, okay? It's probably why you getting transitions. That's why that's probably why maybe you moving. Maybe you getting moved to somewhere so you you ain't gotta explain shit. You just going cause you don't want nobody to know where the fuck you going in the first place. Somebody trying to dig up some dirt bad as hell. They are pressed. Why girl boy, girl, y'all whole TV show cause they are digging, honey. They like, who are you really, really? They digging for dirt, vice versa. Okay, somebody digging up on dirt on you, okay? Because somebody made somebody like, why you always talk about that person? Why you care? I got to get a fuck. Or they haven't, or the other people they've been creeping with haven't been hearing from them. You feel what I'm saying?
Gotta do this. These people doing the same shit, different day. So every day they try to find some shit. Every day they looking. Every day they digging. Like, um, inspect your gadget type of motherfuckers. I don't know what the fuck is that. Do -do 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 that shit. But you like Wado. Can't find Wado. No goddamn one. Okay. Somebody do the same shit every day. They ain't got just looking for shit. They miserable to talk shit about. They're not done talking shit. Cause they mad. I guess they're trying to validate their feelings or something. Trying to make you seem like the bad guy, but really, I just don't think you want people all up in your business. You know what I'm saying? Especially people who just asking you shit just to be in your business. It's not like they're gonna do anything. It's just they just wanna be in your business. You feel what I'm saying? And somebody talking shit, cause you don't you just you just ain't telling nobody shit, okay? Somebody trying to be nosy. Didn't I say somebody trying to be all the I feel like somebody don't want shit. They just want to be in your business. They don't want shit. They just want to know what you got going on. So they can have something what they like to have going on, okay? They already be competition against you. Like, why do it matter what you're doing if they paying attention to their own life? Why do you matter so much? <laughs> Unless you're the person that affect these people's life. Unless you make these people have life. I don't know what the fuck they want from you, baby. They want something. This ain't gonna be long either, y'all, because I gotta finish my time to go, time to go, time to go. Somebody married for money. Okay. Somebody who married somebody for money so they can feel comfortable and stable and feel like they can have the rest. But there ain't no love there because they still, what? All up in your business worrying about you. Okay, somebody married for money. Somebody probably thought they was gonna marry you for some money. Somebody thought she was their meal ticket or something. Okay, this person is sheep and wolf, I mean, wolf and sheep clothing. They ain't nothing but a dog, they a dog, they a dog, they a dog. Treat them like a dog, bark, bark them like a dog. <laughs> that's my dog, that's the dog, that's the dog. Because I ain't even putting that on wolf, because wolf's mate for life. A dog, that motherfucker wrong, okay? <laughs> Okay, fishing for comments. Okay, I don't know if somebody leaving you comments or somebody fishing for comments or they'll post something hoping you a comment or anything like that. Okay, somebody be trying to post shit, fishing for comments, making this, you know, when you decide to say something, but they hold a grudge. Yeah, because they behind a fake ass account. So you got somebody fake ass account, fish for comments, probably say, say something, comment something. Or post something, I want you to say something about it. Or mention certain shit. But this person a grudge, oh, that's somebody you don't deal with no more. Okay, somebody holding grudges. Somebody who never liked you in the first place. But they don't like you in the first place, but they watch. <laughs> Behind the fake pics. They, you can't know it's them, though. You can't know it's them. Okay? Some of y'all about to get some unexpected money. That money looking, girl, I keep hearing money. Okay? I love, I love my motor chicks, but I like money. I like sex, but I like money. Somebody like money. Y'all about to come up to some unexpected money, okay? And <laughs> maybe y'all money been funny, but somebody broke as hell. Somebody think you the jackpot. Maybe somebody trying to marry you for money. Maybe they think they feel like they marry you. They be straight, because you straight, you know? You always have money, or you like the jackpot. That's why this person a wolf and she clothes, because it's a user, okay? This person really don't fuck with you like that. They be holding grudges and shit, because they really jealous of your ass. But they feel like if they team up with you, they broke ass and have some money too, okay? When their money won't be so funny, or somebody wants some help out, somebody broke his head, okay? A romantic love affair. Some of y'all are six feet. Some of y'all probably fuck. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Maybe some of y'all do to do with. You know what I'm saying? But you got a romantic love affair. They 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 into you. So I guess some of y'all supposed to have some. Um, somebody's just supposed to be a friend with benefit. Sex buddy or something. But they really into you. Like they just can't. 
just have sex with you. And besides, they ain't letting nobody get that sex. Because they like, that shit is like, while I imagine, that shit some other, some Aquafina shit. This shit is some goddamn hug me tight, grip me tight type shit. Like, this shit fits. Like, I don't know what it is, but romantic lovers into you. They miss your good chemistry and vibes, okay? And then some of y'all got somebody trying to get in because they feel like you're very fortunate and shit, okay? Some of y'all too busy winning. They see y'all winning. You always win. Okay, let me y'all too busy winning. Y'all be a queen rising. Okay, and somebody want you to give them some money. You stepping into your, somebody see you stepping into your goddamn power. They're like, oh yeah, she hit a peak. Somebody want you to give them some money. <laughs> give them some money or he hit his peak. And all they do is start drama. Maybe they spend all that time and make money instead of starting drama. Maybe they get some money and won't be so broke. Okay, but broke people start drama. Okay, because I don't see nobody with money who's making money got time for drama because all they got time for is making money. Right. This Capture told me, like, if if it ain't about your money, it's, it's bullshit. So, this is how this person is. Then you worry about their money instead of who they gonna um, try to use and shit on. Walking like this, nosy ass bastard. <laughs> Is it three? No, it's not three. Okay, y'all. I hear the buses. The kids should be gone. Let me see what's up, Sarah. Y'all too busy winning, though. Somebody see you winning, they trying to hop on the bandwagon, but you say this competition coming along. It's giving me that y'all seeing that who not supposed to come on the journey with you as you elevate and, and you went to another elevation. So you're going to leave these motherfuckers exactly where they at. Okay. You was just there for a minute, not a long time. Okay. All right. We got action. Okay. Speed and moment. Action. Rushing. Exciting times. Travel. Somebody trying to travel to you. Okay. Somebody about to give in. Somebody meeting the feet or something. It's like, <laughs> let me see. Somebody's meeting the feet. Somebody about to take action. They're like, no, nah, I ain't can't. Mm -mm. I got to let them know, like, yeah, you won. You right. I'm wrong. Like, yeah, type shit. Yeah, because without you, they got lack of direction. They don't know what the fuck going on. They feel like they being blocked. Somebody's feeling blocked. Somebody want to come back to you. <laughs> oh, somebody's rushing in. Okay, something's about to gain memento. Okay, somebody's work is finally paying off, too. Somebody's missing the defeat, so they're taking accountability or some shit. Okay, they, they're feeling blocked without you. They feel like, I don't know. Oh, you and them ain't getting nowhere. Okay, delays. Okay, patience is needed. So I don't feel like this patient, this person need to rush, but they feel like they got to rush because if they be too patient, you're going to dip off somewhere else or you're going to do something else. Okay? One who's calculated and unconcerned about, about the feelings of others. So, indecisive delays. So somebody rush something or somebody be moving too quick or somebody be just doing shit so fast that they um leaving evidence or leaving some shit behind. But somebody wanna meet defeat about something because since you've been gone, they, they lack self control. Whoever this person is, they lack self control like a motherfucker. Patches is needed, okay? Somebody's guarded and protected by this person. This person indecisive as fuck. They don't give a fuck about nobody, only if it benefits them. This person they use her. Somebody just use her and whoever this person trying to come back in. Maybe they can't, they being blocked, okay? But you sitting they ass for who the fuck they want. <laughs> okay. You seeing the truth about this person. Challenges. Lifestyles, unconditional relationships. So this person don't believe in a modern relationship, okay? They be abusing their motherfucking power and their authority, okay? This could be a father figure of some type, okay? It should be some type of mentor, some type of guiding, 
God is person, like somebody that guides people or leads or teach or something like that. But they've been abusing their power like a motherfucker, playing games and shit. Okay, now they better get some karma, injustice, corrupt, lack of accountability, and they still ain't taking accountability of their bullshit. They make excuses for it or make you feel bad about some shit they doing. Yeah, this person disharmony and connection. This person can't love no damn body. Y'all got somebody who's trying to rush in. They really ain't rushing in because of the love. They're rushing in because they want to use somebody. This person is not a love. They just know how to use. Okay? They like to plan illusions and shit. Okay? They just trying to do some type of shit in the moon, I guess. Okay? But you found the mental strength. Whatever moon work they tried to do, that shit did not work because you found the mental strength and you coming out of isolation. Like, maybe this person maybe was doing more work on you, so make it seem like that. Like, I don't know, maybe he gives me somebody that stays in the house all the time. And that they person be out there, but they ain't got to worry about you because you stay in the house because you so hermit. But now you about to come out. You coming out now. And I don't know, you about to find some shit out. Or this person do some type of new magic or some type of magic to keep your ass content. But... Like, for some reason, some shit ain't working because they disharmony, you know what I'm saying? How you gonna try to do magic but do fuck shit? And before you do the magic, they already see the fuck shit you doing. Then you trying to do the magic like they don't see it, like it's an illusion, like they tripping or something. But they ain't tripping about shit. They coming out, baby. And <laughs> you about to let the world know. Okay, yeah, you moving for, forward. Okay? Because you notice somebody's repeating the same patterns. And able to move forward. Repeating the same patterns. Maybe this person do the shit so repeatedly, like, you know they every move. You know somebody every fucking move, because that's how oh, so addictable they are. Bad advice, can't cup in reverse yet. It's a father figure. Okay, alcohol, they like to drink and shit. This motherfucker's a whole scam of fraud. Okay? Look out on it. It's selfish motherfucker. Y'all dealing with a selfish motherfucker. Okay, opportunities. Somebody missed the opportunity. Now see why you dodged the bullet. One more, and I'm going to let you go. Or they won't let me put my introduction in here. Yeah. Lost the opportunity with the um, Queen of Cups, your nurturing ways. They thought you were so nurturing and comparing and, and nice and stuff. And you balanced and a motherfucking resourceful. Okay? They thought they were going to juggle you. They thought they were going to keep playing games. And you wasn't going to go nowhere because you're so sweet. It's consistent and everything else. All right. And also, some of y'all about to get somebody rushing back in who want to say they're sorry, but they ain't going to fucking change y'all. They're just saying sorry so they can get back in, good with you, and get, you know, whatever. But then they're going to fall back into the same patterns, okay? So if there's somebody you know about to come back in and they selfish as hell, let them be by their damn self, okay? Don't get back in, all right? Because they ain't learning. They're going to have to action got to speak louder. And it's got to be more than a 90 day. You know, they'll they work on it until they think it got you back until they recoup back to their ways. So, don't deal with it at all. Or, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. What to tell you? Because it's, it's a lot of fuck. But this person's selfish. It's an opportunity. You can be one of them niggas just trying to find somebody to help them out. They always doing bad. They come with sob stories so you can help them out. <laughs> or women even way. Don't matter. Girls do that shit too. Women and men do it too. But I'm going to let y'all go. Watch your thoughts. Treat others like you want to be treated. And don't be so judgmental because you know this kid is about to go. And I'm about to bounce like a damn cat. Some food. I told my daughter to text that shit. I keep forgetting. Every time I get home, I forget about them damn cats. I'm like, God damn. All right. All right, y'all. If it resonate, good. If it don't, that's cool too. Catch me next time. I'll probably be back later anyway. All right. Peace. Love. Happiness, y'all. I'm gone. Peace.